You were both in Skull and Bones, the secret society. It's so secret we can't talk about it. What does that mean for America? The conspiracy theorists are going to go wild. I'm sure they are. I don't know. I haven't seen the web. Number 322. <laughs> <laughs> you both were members of Skull and Bones, a secret society at Yale. What does that tell us? Uh, not much because it's a secret. <laughs> Is there a secret handshake? Is there a secret code? I wish there were something secret I could manifest. 322, a secret number? Uh, there are all kinds of secrets, Tim, but one thing is not a secret. I disagree with this president's direction that he's taking the country. We can do a better job, and I intend to do it. And we'll be watching. Be safe on the campaign trail. John Kerry, thanks yes, for joining us. And we'll be right back. It's good to be back at the Council on Foreign Relations. As uh, Pete mentioned, I've been a member for a long time and was actually a director for some period of time. I never mentioned that when I was campaigning for re-election back home in Wyoming. Senator Clinton, how you doing? I'm good. How are you? Can doing? I ask you a quick question while you sign that? Sure. It was reported in June of 2006. You attended a meeting in Ottawa, Canada, the Bilderberg Group. Can you comment on that? What do you, what's going on at the Bilderberg meeting, and what do you guys talk about up there? <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. I was reported you were up there, and people saw you up there. I just want to know what you guys talk about and meet about up there. Uh, sir, I don't Why know. Why are there such top secret meetings? I have no idea what you're talking your about. Your husband went to a Bilderberg meeting, too. Yeah. I'm just wondering. I'm not being rude or anything. No, I, I, I just, I I just want to know what happens at these meetings. Well, uh, since I wasn't there, I have no idea. Okay, thank you, Senator. Right, thank you. How are you? There you go. Thank, thank you very much. much. Uh, listen, uh, I, I am. Uh, uh, a happy member of the Bohemian Grove. I like the, uh, the folks who come there, and uh, it's really inappropriate for me to uh, talk about a uh, uh, the group beyond that. Thank you. Have you been there for the ceremony with uh, the cremation of care? Uh, uh, frankly, that's, uh, that, uh, I don't think that's something I need to talk to you about. Have you been there for the ceremony with uh, the cremation of care? Uh, uh, frankly, that's, uh, that, uh, I don't think that's something I need to talk to you about. Really? That's right. Well, I'm Alex Jones, and I snuck in there in 2000. I'm the guy that blew it wide open. And got the video. It's been on national TV. Well, I disrespect you for that. You do? I do. But there's a lot of big public officials going in there. You don't we deserve to know? You took an, I don't know anything about you, and I don't know anything about your film. But if you go in there with an understanding, you violated that understanding by releasing that film, and I don't respect you for that. Really? Oh, you, yeah, you, I'm sorry, public. you took an understanding when you went in there that you would not do that film. And you did, did you have an understanding when you went in there? No. Did you crash it? Yes. Yeah, and it has no trespassing signs there, too, doesn't it? No, they put yes. them after. Oh, I'm I sorry. Just in. I'm sorry, sir. I've been there before. I know what, I know what the circumstances are, and I'm sorry you uh, violated the understandings. But it was not, that was not a gentlemanly thing to do. Well, what about the ritual? Is the ritual gentlemanly? <laughs> You, I, I, don't, I don't owe you this comment. I know. I you, 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 you have, you, this is what's called ambush journalism, and I disrespect you for that as well. So thank you, you and goodbye. Is that an original? That's none of your damn business. Oh.